Yo, what's going on guys? This is Win and welcome back to another video. Today's really awesome because we have some amazing announcements that just dropped on PUBG Mobile's official channel. So earlier today, they premiered the third anniversary Drop the Beat event. And if you guys checked it out, I got to play with one of the DJs, Alesso, for the entire event. It was super cool, but they put some other big announcements in the live show, including some announcements for the PUBG Mobile Pro League. There's going to be a lot of new changes coming for the pro scene and competitive play. There's also an announcement here in just a second we're going to watch based on Karakin. But more importantly, today's video is about the Godzilla event that is coming up very shortly for the new Godzilla vs. Kong movie. And we had a Godzilla crossover event a long time ago on PUBG Mobile, and it looks like they may be bringing it back. Today's video is sponsored by OnePlus. We're going to jump in and check out some of the new Easter eggs and kind of teasers that we found on Erangel. And we're going to do it, of course, on H. HDR and extreme graphics so we'll be checking that out on oneplus here in just a minute but first i want to do a quick reaction to all of the things that went down in this anniversary event so without further ado here we go now over the past three years pubg mobile has continued to bring fun and innovative new content to our players all over the world in terms of classic gameplay we've continued to update classic maps while introducing new maps exclusive to pubg mobile so that all mobile gamers can enjoy fresh and original content on top of this we are continuing to add new and interesting gameplay content that brings endless fun for our players with that said here's the second big announcement i'd like to share with you so this is for karakin Let's go, dude. There it is, Karakin. April 7th. Okay, that was actually pretty quick. There you have it. On April there we have it. So on April 7th, that's uh, today is the 21st. So it looks like that is in 17 days. That's actually pretty fast. That's two and a half weeks. We have a brand new map coming. I'm sure he's going to talk about it here, but the exciting thing about Karakin is it's as small as Livic, if not a little bit tinier because there's a lot of water. And it has 64 players, so there's actually three extra squads that we don't currently have on Livic. So I know a lot of you guys love Livic. It's crazy, 52 players. Well, Karakin is even smaller, and it has even more players. That's why I'm stoked for it. Seventh PUBG Mobile's sixth classic map, Karakin, will finally be available. Kara whoa, whoa, whoa. Karakin? Have we been saying it wrong this whole time? Karakin? Karakin. It looks like Karakin, bro. It's not like Kraken, like the, the Kraken, like I'm in a Pirates of the Caribbean movie. Like K R A C K E N Kraken. Man, I feel debated, dude. I feel like I've been saying it wrong this whole time. What the heck? Featuring new maps, new items, and new game mechanics, Kraken will be waiting for every player to take on its challenge. We can't wait to see you on the battlefield in Kraken. Will you be ready? <laughs> Finally, the I feel like they told this guy, they're like, bro, say the name of the map many times. Say it like three times so people know that it's pronounced Kraken. Not Karakin. This guy's like, hey, new map, Kraken. Check out Kraken on Kraken coming on April 7th. Kraken. <laughs> okay, we get it, dude. Piece of good news it's Kraken. One. Oh, no. Make that two 100 meter tall mysterious visitors coming to the world of PUBG Mobile. One of them you may be familiar with. Any guesses? Let's take a look. Any guesses? Hmm, maybe? Maybe it's Godzilla. Let's go. Oh boy. Yo. Oh, Rage Gear? Yo, let's go, dude. Let's go. Oh my god, this is so sick. Let's go, dude. So there it is, PUBG Mobile X Godzilla versus Kong. Happy birthday to PUBG Mobile and a special hello to all you PUBG Mobile players out there. I'm Adam Wingard, director of Godzilla vs. Kong. It's a pleasure to join you in celebration of the third anniversary of one of the most popular mobile games in the world. As you may have heard, Godzilla vs. Kong will be released on March 31st, and as my gift to you, we're making a brand new mode available that will give PUBG Mobile players a special encounter with both Godzilla and Kong. 
get ready for all the action. And once again, happy third anniversary to PUBG Mobile. There we go, yo. You heard it from the director himself. We have a new game mode. I think that's pretty insane. I can't imagine what they're going to be doing, but he said we can interact with both Godzilla and and Kong. So Kong, King Kong, he's going to be new to PUBG Mobile. We had the Godzilla stuff before for the uh, the most recent Godzilla film, but that was still like a year or two ago. So now we've got King Kong coming, and I mean, let's keep watching see what they say. Wow, I can't wait to see these two old friends in the world of PUBG Mobile. Look at I don't know if I'd call them old friends, bro. Did you miss the part about the trailer where they're like trying to murder each other? I don't know. I don't know if I would call them friends this new collaboration and hopefully more surprises in the game before we move on we also want to share the latest news about pubg mobile e pubg mobile esports okay Our pubg mobile pro league pmpl is the highest level of competition in each region this year we're heavily expanding our pro leagues around the world adding seven new leagues to bring fans more excitement and entertainment than ever before all right so this is the part that i was talking about i didn't know if i was going to cover it but it looks like it was right here after the uh the kong announcement so we have the pmpl uh, e, uh EMEA, which is europe middle east and uh africa and then we have pmpl south asia which is uh new as well that's pretty dope though so we've got a ton of new things coming to the competitive scene but again um, that's not what this video is about. This video is about the Kong event, King Kong and Godzilla coming up here in PUBG Mobile. So now let's hop into the game again. We're going to hop in on our OnePlus, and I'm going to jack up the graphics to HDR Extreme, and we're going to check out all of the cool little Easter egg teasers coming inside of the game. All right, we're in game and check it out. We got a brand new mythic outfit from that very painful premium crate opening last night, but I want to show you guys real quick. We are actually literally rocking HDR Extreme again. This is pretty insane for uh, OnePlus. On my iPad Pro 2020, if I go to balanced, I don't even get 90 frames per second. If I go to HD, I lose even extreme. Now, the reason that the OnePlus doesn't have 90 FPS is because it just hasn't been enabled yet. This is literally a brand new phone that's not even out yet. So we're waiting for PUBG Mobile to turn on the 90 FPS option, but we will get that. But like I said, I've never even seen a phone that has HDR and the extreme option still even available. That's pretty crazy. So we've got that here. We're gonna check that out. We're gonna check out all the cool things coming into Erangel. We're gonna hop into solos because I don't want any squads to come kill me. I just want it to be chill and I just wanna check out all the fun stuff without the, uh, without the chaos. So one of the coolest things that we can see right off the bat actually around military, I'm gonna go. I know that there is a footprint that is also very close to a fairly big claw mark on the side of the police station. A lot of you may have noticed this. Dang, man, look at the lighting. I love when the sun just kind of peeks around that cloud. It looks so good. You get those rays of light, dude. It's so insane. This looks crazy. All right, so the first thing we can check out, I want to get a gun, so I think we're going to go to the police station. You know, you can never be too safe. I don't know why we call it police station. Uh, there's nothing about it that looks like police. It's like a barracks. Can we see the footprint from above? That's the question, actually. Hold on. While we're flying in. I think it's over there. It may not have rendered yet. But there's definitely some giant footprints in the dirt. So here's the first big thing that we can see. We have this claw scratch mark that's popping up on some of the walls around Erangel. You can see this uh, barracks building police station has it. It's also on the side of the school. This looks pretty sick, though. It's kind of subtle. You may not notice it, but, like, that definitely was not there before. And then, last but not least, actually, I'm just going to go for it, man. We've got a bike. I think I'm safe. We're just going to full send it, see if we can see this giant footprint. There's one by Novo. Um, and last time, there was some footprints when they did the Godzilla event before. There were some footprints down in the dirt, like way down here too, in the uh, in the sand on the beach. So that could be there as well. I haven't gone down there in a long time. Oh God. Okay, I think that might just be a bot. I think we're fine. It's it is fine. I don't want to die. I just want to see the giant footprint. Where is it? Might be a little bit further. Here it is. You can see kind of the triangular shape of like the uh, the toes. Yeah, we have a lot of big footprints coming. So this has been in the game for a couple days. And we thought maybe, for those of us that have played the game long enough, we knew that there were Godzilla footprints before. 
and it looks like this might be coming back. We just got confirmation, so our hunch was correct. And I guess it's up to us now to wait and see what this new game mode is going to entail. Also, I wanted to put in this video, I know you guys were going to remind me, I just found this out too. We have some chains on Sandhawk, and there's a couple little Easter eggs here too, including this little miniature King Kong, which is super cute. But we all know Kong is the king of the jungle, and what better map to have that featured on than here on Sandhawk. So we saw in the trailer, Kong was kind of like trapped in some chains. And this might be kind of an Easter egg for that, too. So we have not only the giant footprints and the claw marks for Godzilla on Erangel, but we also have some chains on Sandhawk. What kind of event could this be? And is it going to span multiple maps? I guess it's all left to be seen here, but hopefully it's going to be coming out very soon. Let me know below, guys, in the comments. What do you want? I oh, got this, this bot's coming after me. We're going to... We're just going to dip. See you later. Bye. Good, good, goodbye, bot. All right, yes, let me know in the comments below. What do you guys want to see for a new Godzilla vs. Kong event? Do you want it to be its own thing, like an Evo Ground, like Payload or Power Armor? Or do you want it to be an event on Erangel, just like 100 Rhythms or Ancient Secret? I think it'd be so sick. PUBG Mobile knows that we loved the Pyramid event. Imagine if they did something like the Pyramid event, but they combined it with Godzilla and Kong. That would probably blow my mind. That would be probably one of the best events that PUBG Mobile has ever had. So I'm excited. Everything's coming soon, man. I did not expect Karakin to be coming out literally in two and a half weeks. So the Godzilla movie is coming out on the 31st. Who knows what we're going to have uh, just around the corner. Godzilla could be lurking just around the corner, guys. That's pretty insane. But anyway, thank you so much for watching today's video. Thank you to OnePlus for sponsoring. And look at this HDR Extreme, man. And hey, look how smooth it is. It's just, it literally feels like smooth graphics. That's how good it is. That's why I'm so stoked. The lighting. On my new 90,000 UC outfit. Uh, at least it's it's shiny. It's painful, but it's shiny. But anyway, guys, that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time.